Hi guys, Lexi here, and today I did Spike from My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. So I just decided to do kind of an inspired look. So one eye is the fire. I know his fire is like green and purple like his body. But anyway, I just decided to use red and real fire colors. So starting off, I'm going to start off with my base makeup. And I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me foundation in the color 210. I'm just putting that on all over my face. As you saw, I put it even over my eyes. So yes, this is going to be our base makeup, and I never ever start with base makeup, but this was needed in this type. And now I'm using my MAC Lip Pencil in Cherry, and I'm going to be placing that, place that on my left eye. And I just kind of made some fire marks, like he was pulling fire out of the other eye into the other eye. Out of my right eye into my left eye. So I just made kind of fire strokes and um, I, I don't know, I can't really describe it. I just made kind of squiggly marks all around, just kind of made fire looking stuff. <laughs> it's, it's hard to describe uh, what I really did, but I basically encased my whole eye, excluding my pretty much my brow bone, and um, just kind of did it. I didn't really work on my eyebrow, nor did I conceal it. So if you want to, you totally can. I just left it how it was. She made some squiggly marks. And now I'm using my MAC color in more orange. My MAC lipstick, excuse me, because I love to use lipsticks because they're my fave. And I just put that all around the fire, just in kind of areas where I thought I would need it. I used a pen, not a pencil, I started to use a brush to put it in more areas where I couldn't really get the full lipstick in there. And now I'm using my Lime Crime lipstick in the color is New York City. So I just took a really, really thin brush and I put some yellow in places where I thought it would look good in the fire and stuff like that. So I know I put that just, you know, around and I put it uh, definitely on my brow bone mostly. And I just, I just had fun with this. This was like the fun, fun side. This whole look is pretty fun and I don't know, it was just totally spur of the moment inspired. I was like, I'm going to do Spike today. Now I'm using my Sigma Cream de Couture palette, and I'll be using pretty much all those purples down there. So Lavender Whip, Cassis, um, Elderberry, and I used also, um, I think it's uh, Chocolate Cupcake or something like that. I'll leave all the names in the description box down below. So I'm just taking Lavender Whip and I'm placing that all over my eye. And I'm singing and I'm dancing. You guys know the job I know. I'm just a weirdo all over. And then I put the blue on my lid and I'm just kind of patting and playing and making things darker because you really couldn't see a lot of it. So now I'm taking Cassis and Elderberry and I'm putting that into my crease and blending out to the outsides of my eye, also making a darker crease and dancing, of course. And I also drug a little bit down to the outsides of my eye, just to give it kind of a smoky effect. And now I used my Milani Silver Charm eyeshadow, and I just did my brow bone there. It's just a nice silver. And now I'm, I'm using my Rimmel, it's like a lash extension thing, it makes your eyelashes grow. But it actually <laughs> makes my eyeliner look really well. And I used uh, my green eyeshadow from CoverGirl, and I put that on top of that Rimmel. And it makes it bright and neon, and I did this before. I put the lash extension on it, I put green eyeshadow on it, and it was like, whoa, this actually looks really good. So that is what I did there. I'm just kind of patting it down. And now with my Rimmel Extra Pop Lash Mascara and my Maybelline The Rocket Volume Express Mascara, 
I'm just putting the Rimmel, or yeah, the Rimmel one on first and then the Maybelline one on second for more volume. So you could put on falsies if you wanted to, I just decided not to because there's a lot going on here, a lot, a lot of drama. So I just wanted to keep my eyelashes more simple than anything, not make those really stand out. So that's what I did there. Now I'm just making my brows more arched with my Maybelline Clear Brow Gel. And now with my Creme de Couture Stigma Blackberry Essence Blush, I'm just putting that on with a painter's brush and just making that very angled and then I just kind of blended that out as well. Take it to the apples on my cheeks. I'll be back into my hairline. And now with my Lime Crime Lipstick in the color Serpentina, which is like a dark forest holographic lipstick as I'm sure you've seen by now. I'm just putting that on my lips, making my bow very defined. This is a very sultry, very beautiful, beautiful lipstick. And that is the finished product. So I hope you guys enjoyed. So I kind of gave you the best of both wor worlds, kind of like a fire inspired one <laughs> eye there. And then the other side is definitely the more glamorous spike look to it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I had a lot of fun making this tutorial. And I'm sorry I danced a lot through this tutorial. Um, I couldn't really get a lot of amazing shots where it was just like me doing my makeup for a lot of this so I do apologize but as you guys can see the finished product not that hard really to complete I just thought I'd have fun and film this for you since it is basically part of my little pony collection so again I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video bye